Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing a softball video. I did a poll on YouTube asking you guys if I should do a softball video or get ready with me. At first it was like half and half. And then and some, and somebody else did it and was get ready with me over softball. But then a few of them switched and then it was tied. So I asked my, 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 my friends if I should do get ready with me or softball. And two of them said softball, so we're gonna do softball. Okay, I think we're gonna do hitting first. So I'm gonna review the bats I use. So yeah. Okay, this is the Avenged Pro Bat in size 31 and then and then the ounce is 20. By an inch diameter is two and one fourth, and then yeah, I don't know. This is just a really good bat, except I never really hit with it. Except I do because there's a lot of hit marks, as you can probably tell. I just don't hit with it in games because those pitchers suck. Um, and yeah, so. This is another bat. This is the Easton, one of the Easton bats. Um, it's a drop ten. It, the color is pink sapphire official softball. Um, twenty nine inch, nineteen ounces, and then twenty two and a half, uh, two, two one fourth inch diameter. And then, I don't know if I said this already, but drop ten. Then yeah, I can't find a drop on this bat, which makes me mad. Um, but this is an axe bat. It's really nice. You're gonna wanna hold the handle about, like where the purple part is, you're gonna wanna put your finger there and swing away. Um, then this bat was like $199 on Amazon. There's also another color, it was like white, red, and gray. I didn't like that one. So this is the bat I have today. It's a very nice bat. Then this bat on DSG was $29.99. So yeah, I personally like both of them. I can hit them very far like down in my shed. So pretty crazy. Then the glove, I use one glove because it looks cooler. <laughs> And um, it's just better. I use the Hyper Diamond in color white by Nike. And I love these. In size medium, I think. But then, yeah. Then, oh, I'm gonna have to take you off. Uh, you use a T. And then this T goes up pretty far. Goes up that far. Then, yeah. I don't know if it says the brand on here. No, it does not. That sucks, but you know, that's okay. Um, and then it's all I use for hitting. I have a helmet, but I don't want to go get that. It's Easton, the medium bat, and pink, like, kind of like a light pink, I don't know. But yeah, I don't hit with a T outside. I mean, I don't hit with a helmet outside. But yeah, we're gonna go get the balls. And then we're gonna start hitting off the tee. Okay, y'all, where you see that rebounder, that's where we're gonna put the tee. Somewhere around that area. Okay, y'all, we're moving the tee over. Okay, y'all, now you have a clear view of where I'm gonna hit it. I have a bag of balls. I need a bucket for them, so. But then yeah guys. Okay y'all, first we're gonna be hitting with this Avenge Pro Axe Bat. Then yeah. So we're gonna open up the bag of balls. And then we're gonna grab our first ball. I'm 14. Sometimes I'll use 10 balls because I like them smaller. If you know what I mean. Like just like like the grip of them and it's just easier for a tiny bit of rip. So let's hit. Pretty far, guys. Um, I don't know if 
be able to solve that. So, <laughs> put the camera there. I think you guys can see that a little better. So, y'all, this is the tenu ball. It's not like that much of a difference. That was not a good hit. I'm not good at hitting guys. But yeah. I'm gonna show you my load. My load's not, maybe not the best, but you know. No, nobody saw that. No. Cut, cut, cut. Okay, y'all, since that happened, we're gonna be putting it like 50 lower. So I hit better. Never mind, I don't hit better. <laughs> Guys, see, this is why I hate hitting. So now, we're gonna be using our 29 inch Easton pink sapphire bat. I hit so much better with this bat. So let's see how this works. First of all, horrible swing. Second of all, I need to stop doing that. Guys, I drop my elbows, so then I swing lower. Not a good thing. Don't be like me, guys. So let's. Still not a good hit, but you know, let's pray I get better. This is why I'm taking hitting lessons. So yeah, I need to go to the batting cage more. Oops. Oops, foul tip. Heads in the dugout. Okay, but like, yeah. This is gonna be a 10 year, 10 year ball. Okay, I need to stop taking my other arm off the, off the bat because that's also another thing of what I'm doing. Let's, you know, let's just go back to the other bat. Okay, another tiny ball. Okay. Okay. Let's take off my glove and see how much better I'll do. Okay, so this is still the axe bat right now. We're gonna take a big swing. We're using a 14 U ball. And let's hope for the best. Hmm. Y'all, no. First of all, let's, let's have a little conversation. I know how to hit good, but something's happening today where I don't know why I'm hitting horribly. Um, like I hit really good, but like I don't know what's happening. <laughs> so we're gonna try like some stuff, tactics. Um, also, you need to let's work on loads so i was at a place so make sure you have your feet aligned first 50 50 both legs like a weight and then then you're gonna go back awesome you're you're holding your bat as like a telephone i know um you can choke up if you want to, but like I like to keep it down. And then, then when you're batting, so this is gonna be like, what's your load? So it depends how fast the pitcher's um, wound up is, whatever it's called. And um, basically, 
if they're a really fast pitcher, you're gonna wanna probably load earlier than just to sit around and go like, oh. So I'm like this. Oops, the ball goes right, and then I, you get a foul tip. So you don't want as many strikes. So what we're gonna try to do is when the ball is coming, you're already wanna be out there and then hitting. Like when the ball gets like more than halfway. Because you're gonna wanna be like this. And then it's gonna go crazy. Then, then yeah. Bye. First set. Okay, also another thing. When you're batting, you wanna keep your head in the same place. So I know I've not been doing that, but you know, that's okay. Because we're gonna try to do that. But then, yeah. So, let's get to it. Alright, so, we got our bowl. And, now we're here. So. Perfect swing, just dropping my shoulders. Or, like, elbows. And my hands. Whatever. Is. Oh, look at that, guys. Look at that. Look at that. Mwah, chef's kiss. Honestly, if we're being real here, it's either pitcher or second base that would have caught that. But you know, hey, we're doing our best here. And then yeah, so now we're gonna use our 29 inch pink sapphire bat drop pin, and we're gonna we're gonna hit it as far as we possibly can. Hitting as far as we possibly can. Okay. So, one thing we're not gonna keep our hands like like falling out of the bat like I was well, like that. But then yeah. Okay. So, I think we're gonna move on with catching because catching is a lot easier than just tossing, <laughs> hitting the ball and then yeah so one thing we're gonna i'm just gonna do a toss up and hit so it's gonna kind of be like front toss so like this okay just like that okay now we're done but then yeah let's see now we're gonna be doing catching catching is actually really fun for me okay y'all this is gonna be quite hard you can see me perfectly fine but you know Chances of you seeing the ball, maybe not so much. I'm try. I don't know if you guys see that. But we're gonna try. One time. Alright, so I'm back. It's a bit windy. I know you saw that. So basically, I hate this glove. I need a bigger one. So, I possibly will get one, but you know, right now, I don't know. It's just like not as good as a catcher's glove, and I love catcher's gloves. So let's try it. unintended okay so y'all I swear I'm way better than this I don't know what's happening today <laughs> oh, and also my knees are really dirty I don't know why I think there's just dirt on them I'm gonna go and get my other glove because right now I'm sucking at catching and I'm great at catching. At least I used to be. Just not with that glove. Alright, y'all, this is my catcher's glove. Um I really like this glove. 
it's very nice in general but then yeah y'all so basically now we're gonna catch with my glove i love this glove but yeah okay so we're gonna put this down here y'all can see how like quick and fast I am because to catch a glove you can get a better, better grip on it it's fair and yeah. nobody saw that that time <laughs> all right so if you're gonna aim for down here you're probably gonna get a pop-up which is nice never, never mind oh also guys I'm using the eye bucket sports rebounder it's actually really nice i love it except except for when i break it so so there's a thing right here you can pull down and then adjust it okay so now y'all now we're down at a lower distance you can probably see that in the way but you know that's okay See. Okay, so now we're gonna put this pop up. With pop ups. Okay, that looks a little bit. But, you know, okay, things happen. Okay, I'm gonna pray I got that in camera view. If I didn't, I'm gonna be sad. But, you know, I'm gonna rewatch it. Okay. I'm Okay, also good news I did. Um, I love catching. So, why not continue it with more catching? <laughs> okay. So, now let's continue more catching. So, now more catching. Alright, so, yeah. So do we make it on a different setting? Oh wait, we're gonna do thumbnails. Okay y'all, now let's do some real catcher stuff. Okay y'all. We're gonna be working on catcher stuff. Catcher stuff is so fun. So now we're gonna we're just gonna work on it. So it's not I fit. So, we're gonna get closer so I actually get more strikes. So, yeah. Guys, framing the ball is the most important thing to like softball or baseball. So, basically, let's say um, it comes over here, catch it, and bring it like right to like your face. And also another thing, do not move. All only removing is this, okay? But then yeah. Okay. Let's say let's say I get a pop up. You obviously want to get up and catch that if there's a run. On the first run you're gonna wanna throw them out. Cause chances are they're probably gonna be running one ball that you jump up. And get it with softball and also you can't let the ball get under your legs because then that'll be horrible because then the runner will actually be running and if there's a runner on third they can steal home if you're like 12 you and all that but then yeah so let's keep catching Also, if you get a ball, okay, and the first runner on first, the, the runner on first is running to second, stand, pop up, put your foot outward like, like that, and then step like that, and then throw, just to get a step closer to second base so it's easier to throw. So, like this. Throw. 
and then and sped up faster with it. Like that, Pab. But then yeah. Catcher is really great position. Although some people would hate it. We're gonna be using a fielding mask, because I actually play two positions. Technically three. Outfield, third base, and catcher, but catcher is like like a really good spot for me because I will be your reliability. And like that. So yeah. Basically, guys, um, also, guys, if I posted this video today, just know, um, I did not do my best. <laughs> Hate to admit it, but, um, I hope I gave you some knowledgeable tips. I don't know if I explained them good, though. Hopefully, I showed them good, but don't trust me. But, yeah, guys, um, don't trust me with everything you see here. Uh-uh. So, y'all, yeah, guys, um, if you saw me practice... I'd be trying my very best. Um, 60%. Not all because I talk about Taylor Swift and other stuff. Oh, also, guys, there's black stuff on my face. That's probably blackout from, like, games with my catcher mask. But, yeah. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Bye. Hello, everybody. Thank you for watching. Next video will be a softball video, just in case you're wondering what it'll be next.